Hey everyone, I'm Kaylee. I'm here with Huntsville Steamworks and I'm here to talk to you about another one of our camps that we have coming up. It's our extreme sports camp and we're going to be talking about lots of different the science behind a lot, lots of different extreme sports. One of the ones that we'll be talking about is the science behind how parachutes work, including why parachutes need to have holes in them to work properly. So you may have noticed if you look at especially like some of the really fancy parachutes actually have holes. They are designed to have holes in them and you might wonder, well, why? Because the whole point of a parachute is supposed to be to catch air. But the problem with that is that of course, parachutes are designed to create air resistance, so they are designed to catch air to slow down descent as you fall. However, air has mass, and when it's trapped under the parachute, if it has no place to escape, it will eventually escape out from under the edges of the parachute, which will cause the edges to flap, and that can actually flip your parachute. So, for example, if I were to take this piece of paper and just drop it with no holes in it, um, most of you have probably experienced this already. You drop a piece of paper from a height, it doesn't fall straight down. It'll sort of float back and forth and sometimes it'll even completely flip over. However, if you cut holes in your piece of paper or you put a hole in your parachute to allow the air to escape somewhere other than the edges, that allows the air to pass through the parachute in a way that's more controlled and it's not going to tip your parachute over. So if I were to cut some holes in this and then drop it again, it would actually fall straight down instead of flipping over. As you can see from our experiments with the paper, the holes are necessary for the parachute to function. So now let's do something a little bit more exciting and take it on a bigger scale, we're going to actually go outside and try this with a real parachute. So here we have our parachute. Um, like I mentioned, here are the holes. We've got holes punched in it, so hopefully we'll see that when we drop this, because of the holes, it will fall safely to the ground instead of flipping over like we talked about earlier. 